So you want a little taste of the RV life? It goes a little something like this. Okay, here we go. Oh. Well, let us just enlighten you guys that it's a rainy day every day here in Tennessee. I love the rainy vibes. Makes you want to get a little snuggled on the couch. Yeah. Maybe make some hot cocoa and watch some movies. Eat a whole bag of Oreos. Is Nay Nay just being cray cray or is it really quieter right now? Looks like that sliced cheese you buy in those individual packets, like the Kraft cheese. I swear, it looks like sliced cheese is on our roof right now. It looks like Dexter. Good afternoon, everybody. Welcome to a special episode of Hanging with the Hanks. Rendition, what is happening? If this is your guys' first time here, we took a tree to the side of the RV. Yeah, one of the branches flew off and pfft, right yeah. on the slide. And we were worried about the gear mechanisms. Did it throw the slide off the slide? Did it throw the slide off the slide? Does that make sense? No. Use the Hanks as an example to plan ahead. Yeah, let's not see if the slide will go in on the day we leave. Let's do it ahead of time. Let's do it right now. So the way the tree hit, it actually hit the kitchen slide and the dining room slide. So it's just a party here. I love the positive energy you're bringing today. You feeling good about these slides? Do you think they're actually gonna go in? <laughs> nope. <laughs> Are you in denial? Yep. Okay, great. Guys, you might not know what this song is because it might be out of your age range. The electric slide. Do the electric. <laughs> no, I don't know what you mean. But that would be a song that people would be like, you don't know what we're talking about. Guess what? I love that song. You can feel it. It's electric. Boogie, boogie, boogie. I still don't know what you're talking about. Oh, dear. Do you guys know what she's talking about? If you yes, know what the electric I slide is, put it down in the comments so Honey. you can explain it to me a little bit better. Pick that up. I just cleaned in here. Oh, ah. Oh, that is so it. And this is why Dexter always like just wants nothing to do with us. He's like, you guys are way too much. I'm going to bed. I guess the main thing is when you do this, if even if you're going to do it quickly, make sure that everything is off the floor. No, it's not time to eat. I said everything off the floor. Are you listening to me? <laughs> we got to make sure the slides are clear. I love you. Okay, don't worry. I'll just get it. I just thought of something. You missing something there, honey? That's right, the clock. How many times have we bought that clock again? Three times. Exhibit A. We had to make a sticker on it to remind us to take it down before we actually slide it in. You can't eat yourself out of denial there, sister. Baby, there's sheets of crackers. You got a little something there. <laughs> it's too much fun. Okay, good. Come on back out. Seems like it went in okay. All right, let's get that inner hot hot back up. Still a little bit of bubbling, but I think I bent it out enough to where the normal part that is straight and flush is, it's gonna make contact first. So fingers crossed, I'm gonna have Nene slide this slide in. We're gonna see if we can truly handle the RV life like they all say. The pressure's on me to hit the magical button. The moment of truth, let's see if this slide is gonna retract all the way or else we are gonna be stationary for a while. 
Well, we don't want to be. We want to be back on the road so we can get out and meet everybody. All right, let's give it a whirl. Ready when you are. Okay, here we go. Good. What was that initial? I heard an initial. Like sound? Me too. I heard it too. I was recording. I don't know what that initial sound. It might have been like the little foam pieces. Like oh. sometimes they make noises. Okay. It's gonna go in. Yep. And that piece isn't making contact with the side wall here, so that's good. Oh, that's good. Can you see the I see the sweat. Look at RV life right here. Like Tennessee <laughs> sweat dripping. You know that hot cocoa I was mentioning before? Maybe make some hot cocoa and watch some movies. Eat a whole bag of Oreos. I'm gonna pass. You're gonna pass on it's the cocoa? It's a hard pass. Okay, maybe pass. later. I am so happy and so thankful that the slides are going in and out. Just enough to get us up to Indiana. That's all we were looking for. We need a small win right now. That's what life is about. You gotta roll with the punches and just appreciate the small things. So we're really enjoying that. This ladder is bent as well. Another small thing that I'm appreciating, at least I can climb up and down it right now. That's a plus, so I don't fall off and break my neck. About, I wanna evaluate this, a turn -a bond. I haven't noticed any leaking at all or anything like that. I've been assessing the inside there where it made that intrusion on the inner cabinet there, and I haven't noticed any leaking whatsoever. So things are looking good up here. I swear, it looks like sliced cheese is on our roof right now. So yes, this is what my life has come to and thinking everything looks like sliced cheese. I'm ready to eat. Hold on. What is what? Hi. You're going to get my apple. This is what I have to deal with. Taking out the trash and then my wife is chasing them down with apples. Oh boy. Now they're never going to leave. I feel like we're gonna get attacked. Like, don't get too close because they're gonna be protective over their babies. Says the girl with no shoes on. <laughs> the other one's like, quick, throw it while they're not looking. Here, ready? Look at their tails going like 90 miles an hour. Please do not feed the wildlife. But I There's think... a sign up at the beginning at the gate that says don't feed the wildlife. For Shackalack and what's cracking RV park. Oh, well, it wasn't on the rule list before. They don't even care. They're on to greener pastures. It's been four years, and after four years, I'm doing it. I'm saying bye to the mud tires. To be completely honest with you guys and myself, they're just not adequate for towing. So I'm gonna switch over to the all-terrain tires starting today. We're gonna still maintain the 35-inch tires, but we're gonna have a much better lifespan out of the tires. Adequate wear and tear, I'm talking quieter, better gas mileage, and cheaper. Listen, take care of D. Okay. You ladies, you guys play nice together. I get to take the tires for one last spin. Your beautiful tires, are you jealous? I see what you did there. D, her little butt end is sticking out there. She is getting some new kicks. Yes, she is getting some tires. I'm not allowed in there while they do the truck. Probably because I'll break something. I'm pretty sure I just saw them wheeling our old tires away. <sighs> we get to say goodbye. I know Carl kind of said goodbye, but Nene didn't really get to say goodbye. And now I'm sitting at this podium and people think I work here. I'm like, look at me. Does it look like I work at a tire shop? If you're wondering where hashtag Carl is, I told him he needs to stay back at the RV and edit. It's a Wednesday and our video comes out on a Thursday. The truck is just about done. I think they're gonna take the, take it off the lift. So, uh, it's exciting. I can't wait for you guys to see what it looks like. All terrain tires, okay? So we had mud tires. Now we're getting all terrain tires. Good. 
good. We were worried. It was not gonna look as cool. The tires look sick. And by sick, I mean good. You know, like what the cool kids say. Let's take your first spin and see how she does. All right, here we go. She's feeling great. Okay, here we go. We're going, we're going for it. Woo! Ooh. Ooh. Feel like it's not as noisy. You know what I'm saying? Our other tires were mud tires and they were just loud when you would drive. I mean, we got used to it after a while, so it didn't really bother us, but now I'm feeling like, now I can hear myself talk. Come on, got, uh, hey, let me drive. I got new tires and I wanna see them, I wanna stretch their legs. Oh boy, oh boy, oh dear. We're almost back. Carl, hashtag Carl is gonna see his D with her new shoes in just a second. What do I think about the new tires after driving back? Well, thank you for asking. I think they're great. I feel like the truck is more quiet on the highway. I got up to like 67 and uh, it sounded fine. It didn't sound very loud at all. If anything, I feel like I'm loud right now. It's good stuff. What did I miss my turn? Where are we? Oh, we are pulling in. Let's see what, oh, oh there's my turn. Okay. Stand back, everyone, coming through. Okay, we're pulling in. We're pulling into Shackalack and what's cracking RV park. Let's see what Carl thinks. Here we go. Da 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 da. Whoa. Yep, he should be outside waiting for me. Yes. You want a CD? It's not bad. I, got I thought it was going to be way worse. I know, they look the same. Whoa. Best friend Goodrich. BF, BFF forever Goodrich. They're muddy already. It's like I didn't lose that on the mud tires. No. Wow, they look great. You like them? Yeah. Don't you worry, I have given everybody my opinion. Oh, I bet you have. Yes, I've said it all. I'm sorry. Let's go take a first spin because I go to the post office. Oh, okay. And you get good. to drive and you get to see if it's quiet. Woo! <laughs> All right, let's take our first spin. Let's literally, let's spin those tires. It is, yeah, because it's muddy right now. It's it is muddy. so muddy. Do you want to like go wash them, spray them off? Maybe. It's been raining like all day yesterday and it's calling for more rain. So it's just mud fest here. Oh my gosh, these are like so much better. You can tell? Yeah, totally. Really? Because I thought I was crazy. Just like the maneuverability, you can't hear them as much. I am always that guy that's so skeptical when everyone's like, Gotta try these out, so much better, so much nicer. Blackstone, new tires, all terrains. You really have to sell it to Hashtag Carl. You changed me, you changed me. Yes. These are seriously buttery smooth. You can tell. You can tell. Wow. We're running at 55 PSI in the front and 65 in the back. Any of you out there that are like the pros with the tires, yes. tell me why you would run those pressures on the front and then the higher pressure is in the rear. Are you asking me since I'm a pro? Yes. <laughs> you don't know. Okay, yeah, please help me and, so, in, in the comments since I'm kind of the pro tire expert. If you're not sure if we're accurate in saying if it's quieter or not, go back to footage of us in the truck driving, like yeah. when you went to get my birthday present. Snap Ola. Yeah, watch yeah. that video and listen to how noisy the truck is with the tires and then come back. Yeah. Come back here and listen and, and let us know. Can you turn sharper? Try it. Oh, this is this is stupid. I, I'm just, this is ridiculous. Okay. I can't even take this. Somebody take the keys. Here. <laughs> For future reference, when Carl says something is stupid, that's a good thing. It's super good. It's like a girl hitting a guy in high school. Yeah. Or middle school. They're like, <laughs> Oh, it's also like when girls are like, shut up. Shut up, but keep going. But it's a good thing. Yeah. So if you guys are curious as to what tires we actually went through with purchasing, they are the BF Goodrich K02. Best friend Goodrich. Thanks for discount tire for rocking it. That was pretty cool. We have no affiliations with them. How much did it run us out the pocket? Like what did we pay out the door with a like 4% sales tax in Georgia? $1,788.23. Okay, well, there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. You gotta take care of the babies. Yes, you do. You gotta take care of the, your 
home on wheels and the thing that tows your home on wheels, so. And Dexter was complaining that the noise pollution inside <gasps> the truck was just a little much for his tiny he ears. He is going to be so excited to know that it's quieter because... Okay, but we're going to go over some tire okay. tracks real quick. Okay. Here we go. Let's see. You, I'm telling you, you can definitely... Are you, you sure are like, it's oh, not in your head? Sure, Carl. I'm just, I'm thinking it's nice. Sure, Carl. <laughs> 